Hi everyone! In this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily add links to your website elements. I'll go over how to add links, how to add links to images, buttons, text, and to the website menu. You can link to other sections on your web page, to other web pages, and also to external websites. It's super easy with the website.com site builder, so let's get started. So here's the template that I've started with and I've modified it already with some of my own content. And I'll first show you how you can add a link to this image right here. So just click on the image within the section and you'll see this quick tool where you can add a link or you can click link to right underneath the image on the left. I'll click link to. So you'll see the top options where you can add a link within your website, either to a web page or to a file. You can also add links to a web address. You can have this image open up in a light box, which is a way to showcase the image by having it open up to be larger while the rest of the screen darkens. And you can also link it to your email or phone number. So I'll link this to a page. And now you can choose which of your web pages you want to link to. I'm just going to keep it on home. Under section and page, you can choose which section you want to link the element to. So for example, I may want to link this image on my home page to the About Deborah section down below. Now I'll click Save. So I'm going to show you what that looks like in the preview. If you click the image, it'll scroll down to this section. Now I'll go back to the editor and show you how easy it is to link a button to lead to another web page. I'm going to scroll up on the home page to the Hero section and click on the section. And I'm going to toggle on to add another secondary button. I'm going to add a label, book an appointment. And now under link 2, I'll click on that. And again, I can choose which link I want to add. I'll click page. And I'll choose to have it lead to the Contact Us page. And now click Save. Now I'm going to show you how you can add a link to an external website. And this time we're going to add this link to text. So I'm going to scroll down still on the home page to my testimonial section. And now I want to add this link to a client testimonial that will go to their website. So I'll click on this section. And I'll click on this block. Under the description, I'm going to add the website name. And you can type right in the block or on the left under description. So I'll just show you on the left to add the link. I'll highlight that text I want to add the link to. And then click on the link to right above here. This time I'm going to choose an external link. I'll click web address. And I'll type in the URL for the web address. Because this is going to an external website, I want to open this link in a new window. And now I'll click Save. So let's go to the preview again. So now when visitors click on this text, it'll open up a window to another website. So I'll go back to Edit Site. So the last thing we're going to do is add a menu item and link it to a section within a page. This is extremely useful if you want to make a one-pager website or highlight a certain section on your page without adding a brand new web page. I'm going to go back to start by clicking on this website.com logo. And now I'll click Manage Pages. Next, I'll choose to add new page or menu item. And I'm going to choose to add a section in page. I want to add a website menu item that will go to the testimonials section on the home page. So I'll choose Site Page, Home. And then I'll choose to link it to my testimonials section that I have on that page. And now I'll add link to menu. So you can choose how you want the link title to appear in your website menu, but I'll just keep it as testimonials. And then click Add Link. I'll quickly rearrange the order of that in the website menu. And now let's go to the preview one more time. So if visitors click on that in my website menu, it'll take them down to the testimonial section. 
So you'll see it's super easy to add links to elements in your website. There are so many different types of links you can add in just a few clicks. Thanks for watching.